Hello motorbike fans, this is Martin and I got some motorbike stuff for you. You join me on the third day of my Luxembourg tour. Today we're going to the north of Luxembourg. Got my first nice pens coming up. Yay! So I basically went up to Wilts first and then now we are somewhere around the Oberwampach area and we are gradually making our way up to Clairvaux in an hour or so. Nice view here, a faster road. Lots of cute little valleys here. Slowed down by a truck in front. Good thing is there's a Excellent view to the right. Yeah, that's really cute, isn't it? Some sheep down there, I think. View straight ahead is not as good. So we better take our time and uh, enjoy the scenery. Okay, goodbye ugly truck. Ah, just in time. This seems to be a faster road. There's lots of these relatively narrow roads. I'm just following a valley. Hello, sporty bikers. We've just passed Clairvaux now. Going a bit slow behind cars, but um, well, plenty to see here. Don't you love a road that's lined with trees? By the way, we are headed east towards Germany. Go across the border soon, I think. Probably the hill over there is Germany already. Ladies and gentlemen, we are coming down. Oh, you can see where the road goes. Yeah, it sort of turns back in the same direction I came from. Okay, little valley, river, nice campsite over there. Let's check out that river. Okay, let's move on. And, ladies and gentlemen, by now you know the rule. Come down the mountain, find the river, cross it, and you're in Germany. Now we zigzag our way back up to the hill on the other side.
Yeah, we're getting to the top. Bit cloudy today. Interesting. Weather says no rain until um, Thursday evening. can tell you're in Germany by the style of the houses. Down there, that's Luxembourg. We'll be back there soon. Okay, made it into Luxembourg again, and we are now following the river Ourt. It's somewhere to the left of me, you can't see it from here. I guess we'll see it later. For now, it seems we mostly have view on a lot of camping stuff going on to the left there. Yeah, there's the sign. And there it is, the river Ur, which also means that everything to the left of it, that's Germany. Situation unchanged, river Urte, I'm in Luxembourg, everything to the left is Germany. What a pretty sight. It seems we have come to a bit of a viewpoint. Let's take my phone out and take a proper picture. This is the town of Beevels. It's funny because the river Ur makes a, a big loop around here, so you get a bit of a peninsula. And uh, it's filled pretty much on the peninsula. Coming off quite a big rock, so uh, it's a few hairpins down. Choose you a little place beyond the roadworks. Nice gardens here at the bank of the river. Which is getting suspiciously wide here, I must say. Okay, that's it for the village of Beevels. I think this river is wide because it's actually an artificial lake. Yeah, you can see the dam right there. There it is. Oh, there's a little church down there. That is fascinating. See if we can take a look at it. In here, I guess. Yeah, it's down there. There we go. Cute little church next to a massive dam with lots of water behind it. <laughs> in God and infrastructure we trust. I've reached the town of Viander. Let's check out what's going on here. Bit of river boulevard beer garden action. Let's loop around here. It's all one way traffic. Understandably, narrow streets. But looking cute. And then we go left over the river Ur again. To the western side of town. 
You don't look fancy. The car in front is very, very slow, so that gives us time to look around. Now that's a church. Really cute houses. And admittedly very touristy with these uh, little restaurants on the side. I guess we're getting to the top here. Yeah, the road turns around. Ooh, careful, road from the right. Yeah, it's good you took that slowly. Thanks for the sightseeing. See you later, alligator. So, we got out of the town of Jan and we're now at the top here and going around what also seems to be an artificial lake. But I don't see much of it. Hey, but it's a nice white road with long curves. Also something that Luxembourg throws at you regularly. And we like it. Yeah, nice view there over the right, to the right. I think we're overlooking the Ur Valley again. Still dramatic clouds, but not a spot of rain today. And as we're getting more inland, the scenery is getting a bit more intimate. I'm okay with that. Oh, who doesn't like a tunnel of trees? Roads lined with trees. That never gets boring. And you know where the road goes. Open view, blue skies, dramatic clouds, windmills, motorbike fans, today you want to be me. Okay, I'm getting close back to my camping pot. It's a very narrow road, I discovered this um, just going to the shopping center and back. Taking a little detour. Turned out to be a really nice shortcut, so uh, I'm doing it again. And then suddenly you get into a small little village. And just as suddenly you are out of it. few nice bends again. I'm happy I threw in this little detour. Sorry that uh, the day is almost over, but look ahead motorbike fans, that just makes it worth it, doesn't it? I fear that is the main road back to my campsite. Okay, motorbike fans, this is the home run. I'm enjoying the last bit of it and enjoying the view. I hope you liked this video, and if you do so, please hit that like button and subscribe if you didn't do so. I'm gonna make it home, cook myself a dinner, and then 
go to bed and catch some sleep for um, tomorrow's trip. I hope to see you there. And may the road rise to meet you.